I think 150k is a pretty good price, you know, especially if it rains, because once it rains, it, we'll get a free shower and we don't have to shower tonight. Wow, it's so nice out here. Uh -huh. After a heavy rain, it seems like we are the only ones here on Wingway's walking street. And we actually, for me and, and us actually, for the first time, went into the apartment cafe. Where are we? What is this place? Reminds me of Germany. Oh wait, look, 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 fishy poke. And uh, my friend Vin recommended some uh, poke. And uh, I loved it so much that I decided to check out their second location. And I didn't know it was actually inside the apartment. Uh, coffee uh, uh, place and uh, we explored it without actually realizing uh, because this place is basically an old apartment building that they converted into small shops, uh, mostly coffee shops, poke, uh, maybe some companies, but it's definitely worth uh, to check out when you're in town and you want some coffee. And it's just nice aesthetics and uh, it's a nice way to see how modern Vietnam actually is now. But with that being said, uh, let's go eat some dim sum because it's my friend's daughter's birthday today. And we are invited. Yay. Uh, what did you buy her? When was the last time you had dim sum? I don't, I don't go to Chinese places just because they're so bad in, in Germany. Oh. My friend Alvin invited me to his daughter's birthday party here and his dad walks in and his dad knew me before I even met Alvin. So, uh -huh. but did you know that I was coming here? No. Oh. Well, he called me, he said, uh, my friend Kyle will be here to yeah. take the table. So, yeah. I said, okay, Kai, you yeah. know, yeah. popular name. Right, so you walk in and you recognize me right away. Uh -huh. Yeah. Oh, so, so Alvin never said anything about no, YouTube no, or anything like that? No, no. Oh, so you watched me before? Yeah. Oh, wow. So, okay. so this counts as somebody Did recognizing like four, five me. Years ago. <laughs> wow. And that you was you? The... Which one? The, the, the reuniting thing. For the. Reunite family. If, if, yeah, 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 yeah. My wife, <laughs> my wife likes you too. Yeah. <laughs> well, we gotta make sure it's me because it might be other people. Might be, might be. Now. Is she the one with the mom in the bed? Right. That right, one. Right. Okay. Yeah, okay. Yeah. So that was one of the first videos but you seen. Yeah, that's, that. that's what I'm talking about. Oh, yeah, mo mom and daughter, right? Yeah, mom and daughter, and the mom's yeah, in the bed. Yeah, 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 yeah. The mom's yeah. laying in the bed. Yeah. 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 Don't hold pay attention. No, no, this guy's busy. Most of the things you say. <laughs> <laughs> so they actually upgraded our table. Well, Whoa. we want to see. They upgraded they our table. Whoa. So we uh, pretty much finished the food and uh, Alvin's uh, daughter finally came and uh, she's late to her own birthday party. <laughs> Thanks for coming out. Yeah, man. no worries. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Happy Bye, Chow. Nice meeting you. Hope to see you again sometime. When you come over there, let me know. Okay, I will. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. All right, see you later. Bye. Thank you. Thank you. Bye, everyone. Merci. Bye. No, we're still here though, we're still standing here, even though yeah, we waved goodbye, we're still standing what? here. We're still standing here. Now what? I don't know. Yeah, we, we don't even know where we're going yet. Okay, go. Okay, bye. bye. And that is a subway right there. Well, not yet, but it will be. And this is the walking street right there, all the way down. And that is the opera house right there. This is one of those uh, city tour buses, and we're gonna see what this is all about. I'm very curious, actually. We're tourists. We're tourists. Yay. We're peanuts. Yay. Let's go. Ooh, I've never done this before in Saigon. This is new. Okay, so we just decided to kill some time in between meals, we have to get hungrier again. 
and uh, that dim sum was really excellent. But uh, this is the city tour bus that is relatively new. I've always wanted to try it, and here we are, just trying it. What do you expect to see on this tour? Seven. I hope so. In 45 minutes to an hour, you get to see Saigon for $150,000. And they're just parked right at the end of uh, the walking street. Yep. Hey, you didn't know that? Yeah, people do follow traffic lights here, somewhat. Yeah, especially in Saigon, they do. Wow. Well, wow. Well, wow. Yeah, some of them do. Yeah. No, we have to go that way. So how was that? Nice. Yeah. It's gonna stop us from just sitting and going in a second round. I don't want to go again. I don't. I don't <laughs> I mean. All right, let's figure out what, what we can do so we can get hungry again. In terms of the tour, I feel like it's a little bit uh, lackluster. It's some nice views, especially if you sit on top. But if there's no room on top, don't sit in the bottom. It's not worth it if you sit inside. But uh, from the uh, top, especially during rush hour, I recommend it to go during rush hour. You get some pretty fascinating uh, views that you usually never see. Thank you. Come on. Okay, one of our first meals together, if you guys didn't know, was actually a Mexican place in Nuremberg. And I wanted to show Joe some real Mexican food. And old boy told me that, uh, whoops, this place, agave. So I don't know why I'm trying to show you the menu, but agave, according to old boy, is the best. And I haven't tried this place yet, but I'm very, very, very curious to try it. And Chow loves Mexican food. Are you gonna eat with a knife and fork? No, you cannot eat with a knife and fork, unfortunately. What does it taste like? Mm -hmm. Meat and cilantro. <laughs> It feels like we're in Mexico. And by the way, I've never been to Mexico, so... By the way, Mexican food is actually my favorite kind of food. Yeah. Yeah. It's not Vietnamese. Can't wait for you to try the fish tacos in California. Spoilers. I'm not the biggest fan of beer, but... I love craft beer, especially the fruity sweet kind. And directly above from Agave is Rogue. And it's run by a Canadian guy from Edmonton. And when he first approached, one way to connect with Canadians is to ask them if they're from Winnipeg. <laughs> Where I'm from. Winnipeg is so interesting that the best thing that they have going for them is North Dakota. They try North Dakota. I've spent, this is the truth, this is true. I've spent nine months out of my life in Winnipeg in actually a town an hour south of Winnipeg with 200 French people. Called what? Uh, Saint Agathe. That sounds French. Saint Agathe, yeah, yeah. Just north of uh, uh, Jean Baptiste. And it's about an hour north of North Dakota and an hour south of Winnipeg. I, I love I love Winnipeg. You, you should actually come visit sometimes. They have a Best Buy. There's two <laughs> Best Buys. There's they got a Best Buy? There's, there's two Best Buys. Come buy a TV. What? Check out the view right there, guys. Check out the view. You sit here, look at that. Look at that. Oh, the top. <laughs> huh? Why do they call you cheap? No, they call me uncheap. Oh. So, uh, the dressing both of us. Yep. Uh, 
on this bridge at night. So chill. My text go in the backdrop. District 1 over here. District 4 over here. So awesome. Look, oh, they're doing a photo shoot too. Wow. Wow. They're doing a photo shoot. Wow. So amazing. Wow. Nice photo shoot. Wow. Wow. I wonder what the view is. Ah, the view is up by Texaco Tower. Yeah, that's a nice view. Wow. Yeah, this is a good place for, 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 for photos. Yeah, now we know.